Hey everybody, thanks for coming back for another quick video. Today, TTMs, I'm going to share um, also a, a couple of cards I picked up recently. And um, yeah, just do another quick video here. So thanks for stopping by, you guys. Let's get right into it. First return, three out of three, eight days, zero fee coming out of Santa Ana, California. And we've got Mr. Joe Sambito. I assume he's at Wrigley. Getting ready to take on the Cubbies. Maybe not, but uh, Ivy, you guys tell me. <laughs> I just assume every park with Ivy is good old Wrigley. So we got him here on the 81 Donruss. 1979 Tops Spring Training Facility. And last but not least, got him on the great 1981 Fleer. Mr. Joe Sambito pitched for, I don't know, how many years? 10, 11, 12 years or so. Um, yeah, he's a great signer, great signer. Okay, guys. Next one, two out of two, 12 days, zero fee, coming out of Tulsa, Oklahoma. Been meaning to send this guy to this guy for a very long time also. Um, just never got around to it. And I have a bunch of his cards, but I only wanted to send two. Um... And we've got Mr. Johnny Ray here on his 1986 Donruss Diamond King. Looks fantastic. And the 89 Donruss Diamond King. Pirates, Angels. He was a really, really good ball player. And um, I don't know why we don't hear too much about him. Uh, maybe because he didn't really play that long. I believe his career was about what, 10 years long? I'm not sure. Um, but it's been, it's been a long time that I've wanted to send to him, and I'm glad I finally got around to it. And I'm glad I, I had both Diamond Kings. I did take the 86 Donruss out of my set. Um, but you know, you can find that card for 10 cents in, in a card shop. And uh, so I figured, yeah, I'm gonna send it out anyways. Have plenty of the 89 Donruss, so anyhow couple of purchases I made. Second year, Burt Blylevin. These cards were each one dollar. So I figured, what the heck, why not? It's a Hall of Famer. It's uh, not necessarily a low number. It's not a high number. I guess it would be like, uh, I don't know, second or third series. But um, yeah, got a little crease. But it's a great card to add to my collection for just a buck. Young Burt Blylevin, future Hall of Famer at that time. Obviously now he is in the Hall of Fame. And can never go wrong with an extra Greg Maddox rookie card. I only had one of these. Um, so let me see. Yeah, I figured that would be on the card. These like uh, bullet holes or cigarette burns, as some people call them. Um, but yeah, a dollar for arguably the best pitcher in the 90s. Um, to me, he is. To me, he's probably the best pitcher of all time. <laughs> but that's just me. I'm a little biased. You guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Let me know which one's your favorite. For me... Uh, probably the Johnny Rays, man. I, I really like the Diamond Kings signed and, uh, finally got around to sign, uh, sending to Mr. Ray and he hooked it up. So you guys, thanks for watching. Hope everybody's doing well. Have an awesome day. Talk to y'all soon. Bye now.